We've come a long way since the Wright brothers took their first flight in 1903. Every day, tens of thousands of scheduled commercial airline flights take to the air around the world. As the aviation industry continues to grow, concerns about greenhouse gas emissions from aircraft are also on the rise. To address this concern, Honeywell UOP developed catalysts and process technology for the chemical conversion of bio-derived oils and fats into renewable jet fuel. Tonight, we honor Chad Kavan, Ralph Davis, Donald Izenga, Dan Ellig, Stan Fry, Tom Colness, Michael McCall, Sonny Wen, Jim Wexler, and Randy Williams for the commercialization of Honeywell Renewable Jet Fuel. The Honeywell UOP renewable jet fuel process is based on a proprietary technology that can accommodate a wide range of oils and fats and convert them into aviation grade and other fuels. The process is fully compatible with equipment commonly used in today's refineries, making it easier for refiners to use existing infrastructure to produce renewable fuels. Honeywell Renewable Jet Fuel can replace as much as 50% of petroleum-derived jet fuel used in flight while meeting current ASTM jet fuel specifications. Depending on the biofeedstock, Honeywell Renewable Jet Fuel can offer a 65 to 85% reduction in greenhouse gas emissions compared with petroleum-based fuels. In March 2016, United Airlines became the first U.S. airline to begin using Honeywell Renewable Jet Fuel on a commercial scale. The airline plans to purchase 15 million gallons of this fuel over the next three years. The American Chemical Society honors these heroes of chemistry from Honeywell UOP for their outstanding contributions to science and their service to society.